Hello, welcome to my channel. Today, we're going to address this trailer. When I first got it, the paint started peeling up right away. And I wanted to fix it then, but I had too much work to do with it, trying to get the grass in my yard going, and I had a lot of loads of sand I had to make. But today, I want to uh, start getting it because I got to use it again, and the sand doesn't slide out very good with this rust on here. Another issue I have is when I want to use my ramps, the uh, covers for them are hinged and they're all rusty and it is so hard to open that hinge up. So I'm just going to get rid of them hinges and make it so those plates just slap on and pin and uh, come on and off real easy. So I'm going to get that done. So let's get started. First order of business is I got to clean it out. I got all kind of debris in here, a little bit of leftover sand. So I'm going to tilt it up a little bit, hook up my pressure washer, get it all cleaned out. Then we'll start some buffing, clean the rust off with the buffing wheel, get it ready for paint. Is it lunchtime yet? Wow, that hurt. These came off pretty easy, uh, a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. That cutting wheel does good. But my idea of cutting a hole here and then putting another tab like this one over here, I don't know if that's going to work because this is not long enough. So either I need to make a whole new one of these or figure out something else. I'm kind of toying with the idea of just putting a bar through here, just leaving a plate off. but. I'll let you know what I decide. Got my big grinder with my big wheel. Gonna start buffing and 
see if I can get this rust down ready to paint. gonna be some work. This ain't gonna be easy. Guess I better get to it. This sucks. Hey old man. Yeah. It's time for your nap. Well you gonna do it? Oh yeah. Okay. I see you're back. Probably went and took a break with all that buffing going on. Now you're here for the exciting part. We're gonna paint. So this is the paint that I've been using to paint my beams with. If you've been watching that series, I'm putting up my lean-to. So I'm just gonna go ahead and continue with this. We're gonna mix it up with this. And uh, I'm just gonna roll it on. I'm gonna pour the paint on and just roll it on. No use messing up a paint tray. So let me open this up and uh, start mixing. Well, I'm ready to go. May seem a little weird, but because I'm videotaping it and the way my lighting is, I'm gonna start from here and go that way. And then I'll just climb out the back but that way I have light looking that away. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just start, I'm gonna just pour the paint on and, and start rolling. I told you. Well, that will do. Uh oh, paint yourself into a corner. Yeah, I was just thinking about that. I think I'm gonna go this corner. Yeah. Fast and easy. Let it dry and paint some black. What I've decided to do here is just make two more of these tabs. One for right here and one for over there. 
and I'm just going to put a, a solid rod through here with two pins on both sides and not even worry about that door. I'm gonna, let's go to the plasma table and I'll cut two of these out. When we, uh, when we not get the audio, I messed up. Got my little piece cut out. Had more dross on there than I should have, but took a little grinding. I got it cleaned up. It'll work. Got my bar cut. Just gonna put this bar here, weld it on there. Put this clip in. A little bigger than I needed, but. It's what I got on hand, so that's what I'm gonna use. So let me get this cleaned up and I'll weld that on. We really should fix the paint on that, but that's for another day. Well, this is a pretty bad well. Well, I ain't no welder, but it'll work. Close enough. Crooked. All right, got both the tabs welded on. Drill a couple of holes, a little bit of primer, and paint it. When we paint the black here, we'll be rolling.
gloss black. Let's do it. Here I am at the back of the trailer. I got it all painted. I got my holes drilled and my rods and they're painted. That one's installed. This one here just goes in as easy as that. And then put this little clip in. And then that holds my ramp from falling out. Well, that's gonna wrap up this video. I really need to do this paint job and I'm glad I got to it and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you again on My Retired Life.